The first session of the 18th Lok Sabha began today on day one as newly elected members of parliament took oath. The leaders of the opposition bloc staged a protest outside the parliament. Prime Minister Modi took oath as prime minister for a third term even as a rejuvenated opposition indicated it is ready to take on the new government on multiple issues. संसद का ये गठन भारत के सामान्य मानवी के संकल्पों की पूर्ति का है नए उमंग नए उत्साह के साथ नई गति नई ऊंचाई प्राप्त करने के लिए ये अत्यंत महत्वपूर्ण अवसर है Opposition leaders including Congress President Malika Jun Karge, Congress leader Sonia Gandhi and Samajwadi Party leader Akhilesh Yadav were seen holding copies of the constitution as they protested against the BJP-led NDA government. वो हमारे लिए एक्सेप्टेबल नहीं है वो हम होने नहीं देंगे इसीलिए हमने कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन ओथ लेते हुए हमने कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन पकड़ा था धन्यवाद द बिगिनिंग ऑफ द सेशन ऑल्सो विटनेस्ड अराउ ओवर द अपॉइंटमेंट ऑफ बीजेपीज बी मथाब एज प्रो टेम स्पीकर द प्रो टेम स्पीकर इज अ सीनियर मोस्ट मेंबर ऑफ द हाउस हु एडमिनिस्टर्स द ओथ टू न्यूली इलेक्टेड मेंबर्स एंड ऑल्सो ओवरसीज द प्रोसीडिंग्स अंटिल ए परमानेंट स्पीकर इज इलेक्टेड as President Draupadi Murmu administered the oath of office to Matab, the opposition expressed dissatisfaction over his appointment instead of eight-time Congress Member of Parliament K. Suresh. They alleged that Suresh has been sidelined as he belongs to the Dalit community. INDIA bloc members of Parliament also refrained from assisting in the oath-taking ceremony. But the Parliament in session the opposition is gearing up to push the NDA government for answers on several issues, including the ongoing NEET exam paper leak case. The opposition has said it will put pressure on the centre to ensure justice for students. The first session of Parliament will run until July 3rd. Following the two-day swearing-in ceremony, the election for the Lok Sabha Speaker is slated for June 26th, when President Murmu will address a joint session of both houses on June 27th. The debate on the motion of thanks to the President's address will begin on June 28th. Prime Minister Narendra Modi is expected to respond to the debate on July 2nd. Let's now talk about what happened in the Indian Parliament today. And uh, joining us now is our correspondent Sidhan Sibol. Hi Sidhan, tell us about the drama that unfolded in Parliament today. Well, Eric, today was the first day of the 18th session of the Indian Parliament. It is a packed session, of course. Uh, uh, we saw that though taking uh, ceremonies has started, it will uh, take two days. It will happen tomorrow as well. We will see, of course, uh, uh, the new speaker being chosen and, of course, the uh, statement by the Indian president as well. But essentially, on day one today, we saw the Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi addressing uh, uh, before the session started, and he sent out a few messages. The first message was that the country is run by consensus. The second was on the opposition. He said that opposition should work constructively. The third, of course, he talked about how uh, essentially uh, when it comes to emergency, where the anniversary will be marked on 25th, uh, it, it is something that was the dark face of Indian uh, democracy. But uh, above all, the message was clear that before slogans, it is the substance that matter and that is what uh, that all the parties should work together. But it is expected to be a stormy uh, session of the Indian parliament given that uh, we have a stronger uh, opposition right now. And of course, we, we know that we have now a coalition government here in India. But of course, led by Prime Minister Narendra Modi, who is the Prime Minister for the third consecutive term. All right, that is our correspondent Sidhan Sibol live in New Delhi. Sidhan, thank you. For all the latest news, download the We On app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.